Hi everyone. I wanted to give you a really brief idea of some really exciting workshops coming up in January. So for those of you who don't know, I'm going to be offering uh, a month packed with some goodies for you, yourself, your body, your mind. Um, because I always feel like after the holidays, first of all, the motivation to, to invite some self-care is quite high. And second of all, we need it. <laughs> so um, this is a stressful time for most of us, um, not only because the holidays in general, but also because of a global pandemic still kind of going on. Um, I am offering um, a series of workshops that you can pick and choose from, or you can take them all together. Starting on January 2nd, I will offer a workshop on letting go and affirmations. I usually do these two together. Um, I love the idea of starting into a new year with some intention, some mindfulness, some breath, some movement. So that's going to be a really yummy um, opportunity for you to just kind of slow down, take a moment and, and remember where you are really and to let go of whatever has accumulated over the last year, which in my case was quite an intense one. Um, so I'm really excited for you to join this. Um, this is all going to be online. Times are going to be posted. So that's January uh, 2nd. Right the next day on the 3rd is sort of a follow-up workshop, if you will, that I have taught as a retreat last year, some of you might remember, um, on healthy habits. One of my favorite topics to think about in the new year is about habit forming and how you can create habits that work for you in your daily life in order to spark change, right? So um, this is a really good workshop if you're looking to get into a new mindset, um, if you feel like something hasn't worked the way you want it last year and you want to make changes. Um, we're also going to work a little bit with affirmations, but this is mostly just about how can yoga, how can mindfulness help me to really get into a new state of being. Um, love this topic. So January 2nd is going to be letting go. January 3rd is going to be healthy habits. Um, on the 4th, so you can see there's a lot of workshops in a row. So right the next day, um, I have a workshop, um, it's a little more health related, on digestion um, and uh, I don't like the word detox but the idea is to kind of help your metabolism get back to its rhythm um, with movement, again with breath, with meditation. It's incredible what the mind can do to support you with your gut um, and after the holidays this is a workshop that I kind of always offer just because who doesn't feel like <laughs> holiday eating is not always something that you feel great after. Um, so that's January 4th. Um, final workshop, um, all of these again are one day, uh, two hour workshops usually or one and a half hour workshops. Um, the last one is a workshop that I've been asked to do a couple of times by several different people and it's a workshop on back pain. I've taught that workshop a couple of times. Um, the idea of that workshop is for you to get better, first of all. Um, I called it Pain No More. Um, and the second benefit that I find with this workshop is to just get an idea and a strategy of how can you help your back long time to feel better, right? So we are going to uh, encounter movements and um, techniques to make you just get into a rhythm and a routine. So in combination with the healthy habits, you could establish maybe a new a little bit of movement routine for yourself. Eventually, that's the goal. Those are the four January workshops. You can see the beginning of January is quite packed with wellness. Um, I'm super excited to teach those. I think this is going to really bring up some new energy um, and some motivation for the whole year, frankly. Um, some of these workshops might be uh, come regular classes on demand. You might have noticed that there are no regular classes scheduled for January um, or for the rest of the year as uh, first of all I'm going to be traveling and second of all I do feel like I can go a little bit more in depth when I do that. So the final announcement maybe is uh, that I do have a little series um, but that is a very special topic. It's a prenatal class that I will be offering for four weeks in a row in January. It is suitable for all trimesters. Um, I would ask you to start practicing prenatal yoga after the third month in general, but after that you can join no matter what. It's going to be a very gentle class. Um, again, we're going to work with breath and movement um, and just getting you into a state of <sighs> relaxation, preparing your body for birth. Um, I love teaching prenatal and um, 
I think you're going to really benefit from that as well. So again, feel free to pick and choose. Let me know if you have questions. Um, I'm very excited to see you guys after the holidays. Um, I'm going to offer those uh, workshops online. So no matter where you are in the world, you will be able to join. I promise the times are all suitable for all time zones. And um, yeah, I can't wait to see you on the map. Um, if you want more information, you can either just message me here or just check out my website, loneyoga.com. I have some information in my news post. Okay, guys, have a wonderful time uh, wherever you are, and I'll see you in 2022.